Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we're going to show you how to change out the Whirlpool dishwasher to lower dish rack. It's going to be a very easy repair and it'll only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new lower dish rack. The lower dish rack is where you put the larger items in your dishwasher. The main reason you'll be changing it out is if it's damaged and the dishes are falling through or it's rusty and staining the dishes. In order to change out the part, we have to open up the dishwasher door. Now that we have the dishwasher open, we're going to pull the lower dish rack out and set it on the counter. Put a towel down to protect the counter so we don't scratch anything. Once you have it out, we're going to take the silver basket and lift it out and set it aside. Now we're going to turn the rack over so we have access to the rollers. There's one in each corner. We have to remove those and put them onto the new rack. To get the rollers off, there's a locking tab on each side. We're just going to press on with a flat head screwdriver while lifting up on that roller to lift up on the tab so it doesn't lock back in. Then do the other side. Once you have it off, you can just set it aside. Then we can do the other three. Once you have all the rollers off, we can change the part. Here's the old lower dish rack next to the new one. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. Now we're going to put the rollers on the new dish rack. You want to make sure this tab is in the back so the silverware basket goes in the right side. To put the roller assemblies on, you just have to line it up with the bar on the rack. And you just want to make sure that this tab goes on the inside. This tab goes on the outside here. And then you just have to set it down into place and lock it in with the two tabs. Once you have this one on, the other three go on the same way. Once you have those in, we're going to turn the rack over and put the silverware basket in. All you have to do is line it up and set it in place. Once you have the silverware basket in there, we can put it back in the dishwasher. All you have to do is set it on the door and push it back into place. Once you have it in, you can close the dishwasher door, plug it back in, and take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.